forgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. Oh my god. I'm scared. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. This is pretty. It actually kind of hurts my eyes. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away. Unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Whoa, I don't remember opening that drawer. I swear to God, I didn't open it. I remember going like, oh, hey, I should open the drawers. And then I touched the thing first. Oh my God, it's freaking me out, man. Let me out. Okay, I need to stop that. That was freaky. Oh my god, there's a door here. It did? What? What? What the hell? That's a book! Oh yeah, what am I thinking? Sorry. I don't know what I'm thinking at the moment. About, Much I don't know, old, not too far. Been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble, and there's a risk everything oh will cave in on us, especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Oh yeah, hi Luke. Sorry. Just not myself today. Oh my god, yes. What is this? Okay, now that creepy music is playing again. Oh my god! Stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. Oh my god. I don't know. So far, it's just the kind of like, I guess it's like the starting. You just kind of like figure things out. 
you get used to it and then it'll start throwing more challenges and stuff at you. I want that. I just realized I was doing it to the wrong one. I'm gonna leave it like up for a couple more seconds that way people um or I could just start reading them but I guess I could try but for some reason I can't talk today okay everybody should be done reading hopefully story reaches all the way back to the time of the 30 years war Said that soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the cold dark woods and were forever damned to roam the grounds. Their bodies wrought by their tainted souls have left them disfigured and empty of essence. Many have cited them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. They are called gatherers as they seem to follow some ambition to still living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap saps dragged out behind them which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? I need to learn how to like read ahead and then say, say it. That's my problem. Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa, the well-known eruditude, visited all Altstadt. Altstadt. Okay. At the start of the 16th century, he resided in a local inn for a fortnight as he looked for remnants of kingdoms past. During his day, all the prominent members of society paid notice. He is mentioned in many records of the time. One day, he went to investigate a burrow in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in. Grenoble some ten years later. He dismissed the notion of ever visiting Altstead, which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods and what happened to him? <sighs> Why do we keep talking about naked? What is this? Stott? Stott? Okay. The Baron of Brenberg lives. Oh, be quiet. The Baron of Brenberg lives a reclusive life with his family at the castle nearby Altstadt. And like most of those noble birth, rumors are inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveals low before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander, a nobleman from the Rhinelands, claiming the role as protector of the Prussian state. Alexander helped the region flourish and remain popular throughout his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to the lineage and heritage. Therefore, the birth of and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This has fed the idea that the Baron is in fact one and the same who come from the West over 300 years ago. Lived through the time of occupation and joined the coveted Order of the Black Eagle along Oh, I want to say alongside. Along with the great leaders of this country. 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 No, country. <coughs> okay. No, the dogs were doing stuff. I want to break this one out. I guess that glass was the weakest. Oh, hey. Holy Bible. King glass with books is hard. Okay. Okay, I guess this one just want, doesn't want to break. 
Oh wait, it's already broken. What the heck? I don't remember breaking it. I know I broke the middle one. I mean, you would have heard the shatter. Yes, more oil. Oil is good for the lungs. Wait. What did I just say? It won't open, it's locked. I can't go back this way. I just throw something down, apparently. Let's find a new way out of this area. We'll go figure. Yeah. Oh my god. Can I pull it? Can I push it? No more. Um. Oh, this looks peculiar. Oh, damn. This is that puzzle thing, isn't it? I'm confused. Remember, remember, like in the last room? Do you think I push it? Like, because I, I went and looked for other books. I know it runs out. Okay, I don't push. What am I supposed to do? There's like no other books like it. I don't think. Oh yeah, there is. Okay. Okay. I see this book. I saw a book. Oh, yeah, that book. And that book. Yeah, that seems about it, right? Okay. I guess it won't work that way. I probably missed the book on that same aisle. I win! I win the game! The game's over! I win! Oh wait. Never mind. Yeah, I got the wines. Oh my god! Motherfuck. Well, Heim and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their abs. Oh, well. I don't know. It did some freaky stuff. They're banned. Absent-minded handling on the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brandenburg. I needed to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they can rot for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would, in a sense, solve both their, both of my problems. I was gonna say both of theirs. See, I gotta stop jumping to like, conclusions of what they're gonna say. That's my problem. Once again, I'm gonna check this. Yeah, I got scared of something stupid. <laughs> 